What is the president going to do next? Well, I believe President Trump should have a town hall meeting in East Palestine. After going there on Thursday and listening to 12 residents crying about what has happened to them, I would like to see President Trump go to East Palestine for a day and do a town hall at night and get maybe 20 or 30 people there to talk to him in a town hall about what they've experienced. This gets back to the roots of Trump, populism, America first, why he won in 2016, because he was the only person who cared about working men and women in this country who who had their back. That fueled his victory in Pennsylvania. That fueled it in Ohio. That fueled it in all those states, Wisconsin. This is how Trump was able to win in 2016. This is the core of Trump. He needs it. We don't need a big rally with 27,000 people. I would suggest Trump go to East Palestine right there, have a town hall meeting, invite the residents, have them come up and speak to him and tell them what they've been through, just like they did in Mastriano's hearing the other day. Maybe, you know, invite Pima or something or or whoever the the FEMA is. Of course, they're not going to go. But talk to the people. Let them tell you, Mr. President, exactly what they've experienced. I mean, this is how you get back to our roots. This gets back to vintage Trump, why we're here. Because he didn't forget us in 2008. And that's why I was such a strong supporter of his from the beginning. Nobody cared about me or my family or the fact that we were homeless or had no money or couldn't eat. No one cared about that. No one gave a rat's tail except Donald J. Trump when he came along. 